Western State. This is senior nose guard Lane Stoop and junior linebacker Jaden Terry. Got a question? Um, the offseason's been doing pretty good for us. We've had a lot of guys step up and be leaders together. Um, lifting workouts been really going well, and spring ball went really well. And um, this summer, we've had a lot of guys stay the summer over. And we've, that was, we've had a while, like 30 of them. And that's been breaking records for us, so it's been actually going pretty well. Uh, yeah, I'd definitely say, especially defensively, um, we have a lot of vets that are coming back, and that's that's really exciting to see. Um, offensively, we do have a couple vets coming back, but we're still growing there, I think. Um, I think defensively, uh, we're pretty strong right now. That's wise. Talk about that. I mean, talk about that linebacking core. I mean, you guys got a lot of guys coming mm -hmm. back. Um, you know, I'm really excited. Uh, this is definitely uh, one of the mo more exciting years. I think um, we got Zach Stansberry and Brian Ansberry. Um, Zach is he's coming into the mix. Um, he's he's done really good things uh, in spring ball, and this summer he's doing really good. Um, and Amsberry, um, he's also doing good. He he wasn't there this summer, but um, he's a really strong player for us, and we're hoping to to do good things in the middle there. So. Jaden, what's your assessment of Stephen Lucero as it relates to him, all of these high-powered offenses? Um, you know, I think speed and aggression are two big things we, we want to work on. Um, uh, just being aggressive out there all the time, um, you know, punching guards in the mouth and, and really getting after it, playing that tough, hard-nosed, aggressive, fundamental football. Do you feel like you're one of the leaders on the defense this season? Um, you know, I think it's kind of it's kind of a team thing. Of course, I'm going to try and uh, lead my defense as, as much as I can. But I think it's really a group effort. There's not really one person that, that is going to stand out. But um, more more just a, a group, um, a, a team kind of thing. Um, a lot of it has to do with effort, I think. Like, if you run to the ball and if you run and tackle, there's nothing you really can do. So as long as we run and tackle and there's effort there and all 11 guys are to the ball, that <coughs> tackle so we could have a lot of success that way. And just a lot of leaders in two, so. And we're hoping our offense could step up. And um, some guys, we're kind of, we only have a few veterans coming back, but we need some guys to step up. And so make it even because we're out there a lot, like 70 plays a game. So it's going to take a lot of stress off our shoulders. You guys first eight in what's Texas A&M tournament all week? Yeah. What's the scouting report, what's the scouting report look like on them? Um, that should be exciting. They're a really good football team. So it's going to be exciting to see if they come and breathe our thin air that we have out there. So. Um, mainly just playing all four quarters. We've, but most of our games we were in last year, and we let a quarter or a couple of drives slip away. That cost us the game. And if we could put all four quarters together, we're gonna really shock some people this conference. Mm -hmm. um, you know, like like what he said, just just playing all four quarters and um, just giving everything we have in each and every game, and just taking it one game at a time. 